us into the newsroom, police body cam footage showing an encounter that Lansing police had with the suspected gunman from 2019. Seven investigator Heather Catalo joins us now with a look at what this video reveals. Heather. We just got this video a short time ago. This is from the night Anthony McRae was arrested for a felony gun charge. And in this video, he admits he knew he shouldn't be carrying the gun outside of the home. You got any weapons on you right now? Huh? You got any weapons on you or anything like that? Yeah. You have a weapon on you? Yeah. What do you have? Uh, 380. 380. 380? Go ahead and put your hands on your back real quick. I'm just going to detain you for a second, okay? Can you put your cigarette out? This body cam video shows a Lansing police officer questioning Anthony Dwayne McRae back in June of 2019. Police say McRae gunned down eight Michigan State University students Monday night. Do you have a concealed carry permit? Oh, I'm working on it. The officer arrested McRae after he admitted he was carrying a weapon without a concealed carry permit. I, I live right down the street, man. So right here? Yeah. Okay. Is it your registered firearm? Yeah, registered. Yeah. Okay. Once he's in the scout car, McRae reveals where he got the Ruger 380 gun. Where'd you buy it at? Uh, the, the uh, pawn shop right there. Yeah, well, you the pawn shop? Yeah. Okay. How long ago did you buy it? I brought that, uh, at the end of March. End of March? How much did you buy it for? Two, uh, 214. Five. You know you don't got a permit for it? No, but I'm working on it. I was working on getting my, uh... Did you know that you needed a permit to carry that 380? Yeah, man, yeah, but it's late. I'm going to the store. Yeah. And, um... Why were you carrying it? Protection. Protection? Protection, man. I get a pack of cigarettes, come here, smoke, turn my head, bring my little gun with me. I know I ain't supposed to. The felony charge was later pleaded down to a misdemeanor. McCray was sentenced to 18 months probation for this case. It's not clear whether the gun seen here is in this arrest is the same one that was used in the mass shooting. Brian and Glenda. An interesting view into who he is, Heather. Thank you.